Hey guys, thanks for tuning in and today we'll be talking about the MacDodo magnetic wireless charger as you can see here in the box and also a little bit about um, wireless chargers in general. So I recently got myself a Pixel 6 and that has wireless charging built in, it uses Qi charging up to I think 21 watts if I'm not mistaken and uh, so I thought well I'd get myself some magnet, um, wireless accessories and if you're familiar with Apple, they have something like this and they've branded theirs as MagSafe. So what they did with their, uh, magnetic, uh, with their wireless chargers is they took Qi charging and they added in a ring of magnets in this device and I guess a metal ring built into their phone to perfectly line up their wireless charger with the phone. And uh, just a little bit of a backstory, uh, wireless charging uses inductance and the alignment of the coils um, greatly increases its efficiency up to I think a maximum of 75 or 80 percent efficiency. Everything else is lost to heat. Uh, that's the nature of inductance. That's why transformers get hot. So Qi charging is basically uh, a standard and it's an open interface standard that defines wireless charging uh, or rather wireless power transfer using inductance charging over a distance of up to four centimeters, which is very cool. That's that much. So that actually should get you to be able to charge through a tabletop if you can put a charger at the bottom and the tabletop is less than four cm, but those chargers are properly expensive, the long distance chargers. So that was a definition from Wikipedia. Getting back to um, this MacDodo, you can see that it does not claim to be MagSafe, it just calls itself a magnetic wireless charger. There's no MagSafe here, there's no MagSafe words here, anywhere. So, but I'll drop a picture of the uh, online platform from which I bought it and as you can see, it actually claims to be MagSafe over there. So, when I got my iPhones, uh, iPhone, Apple, I don't use Apple, I use a Google phone. So when I got uh, my Pixel 6, I basically uh, decided I would get a magnetic ring to, be pu to put on the back so that I could start to use uh, magnetic charging which is uh, actually quite a good idea and uh, so I looked for MagSafe because I knew that was a standard um, that, had, that Apple had already established so it would be easy to purchase things and make it interchangeable anything that was MagSafe it would fit so um, MacDodo uh, being sold as MagSafe I naively bought it and this is it and this being uh, one of the first few things that I was buying, I did, was not aware that uh, there would be discrepancies to be aware of. So McDodo uh, as a whole, as a brand, makes really good uh, equipment. Uh, some of my power delivery chargers and all that, I buy them. So I bought the magnetic wireless charger. The thing is, this is 59 millimeters in diameter, if that comes up on the screen. And when I got the delivery of my MagSafe aircon vent holder for my car, I tried to clip it in and as you can see, it does not fit. So uh, a MagSafe by definition is 55, di uh, 55 millimeters in diameter. So the OD, the outer diameter of the puck needs to be 55 millimeters, no more, no less and it'll fit into uh, all MagSafe standard holders. So I contacted the seller. The seller's name is uh, AlphaTech. Uh, I use it on, on the Shopee platform. And initially their response to us was, hey, why didn't you just read the description? It's there. And my response to them for that statement was basically, you called it MagSafe, and MagSafe by definition is 55 millimeters. It's like calling something USB and when it arrives, it doesn't fit. And you tell me, hey, why didn't you read the description? So anyway, AlphaTech is an honorable store. They said, no worries. Send it back to us, we'll refund you your money. So I'll be sending this back to AlphaTech. Um, if you're dealing with them, don't worry about it. They are really great people. I think it's just a small misunderstanding. So guys, uh, just to repeat, MagSafe is by definition 55 millimeters in diameter. And when I got a response from AlphaTech, I basically did, um, did a bit more digging. And if you look at this charger, uh, it's by Anchor. The diameter is uh, 62 millimeters, and this U green charger is 59 millimeters. So there are a number of chargers on the market, uh, probably wrongly um, advertised or misadvertised due to lack of knowledge. 
as MagSafe. So when you want to buy a MagSafe product, if it is important to you that you're going to use MagSafe accessories, ask the diameter if it is not published. Not all of them are published. Like the Anchor and the Ugreen, I had to ask the vendor. And they were kind enough to send me the measurements and yeah, hey, they don't fit. So that's about it, I guess. Um, MagSafe does uh, improve efficiency because it helps you align the coils and also and gives you a universal standard to follow, I guess. Um, initially, Qi charging was 7.5 7 watts, um, and I think MagSafe goes up to 15 watts, but Qi nowadays can go up to 20 and I, I think even 30 watts easily. It depends whether your phone is capable and uh, whether your charger is capable. This is a 15 watt charger, if I'm not mistaken. The one I'm buying is 20 watts uh, to replace this, and that'll finish this and my phone goes up to 21 watts uh, Qi charging, so I'll be using that. So guys, I hope this was useful. Um, and to those new wireless charging users out there, I hope you all don't go through the trouble. I'm, I'm only going to be out like seven ringgit to send this back to Alpha Tech, but at least they, they are a good store. I was lucky that they are a good store and willing to take it back because honestly, I can't use this for anything else. The purchase purpose was to use it in my car <laughs> and it, I can't use it but anyway uh, AlphaTech solid store thank you hashtag AlphaTech and I think that's all I have uh, for today and to sh the sharing for this wireless charging in general uh, I think it's a very useful technology I have a couple of other products I might review in the future like little docks and stuff like that but for now uh, this is this is my these are my thoughts on the McDonald wireless charging MagSafe in general and Alpha Tech as a really good shoppy store. And thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.